make the strings louder. Really, I have no idea fire. where I'm going. You need to help I me out a little hold bit. Hold on, I'll tell you the story. Come here. Come here. Come this way. Come this way. Every time I turn on my light, it turns off. Guys, shut up. We need to listen gentlemen. to the story. These two fine gentlemen, okay? This is Chris right here. This is him. He's got the, the policeman hat and everything. Like that. He's the police officer in 1683. He was a police officer. This is me. I'm an aristocratical person. I don't know if aristocratical is a word. Um, but I'm an aristocrat. Uh huh. Uh, I have a mop for. There's one in here somewhere. I have a. Is that a suitcase or a cigar box? What is that? I, I think that's a book or a chair. No, or that's. No. Yeah, that's my that's my doobie box. The volume's down. Too, so I have that okay. right there. So. Gotcha. Anyway, <coughs> moving on in history. So Chris, the policeman, uh, was good friends with me. Um, Don't want to freaking turn around. I this is Parliament right here. This is Parliament in England. Y if you didn't know, I'm British. If you couldn't tell, I'm right here. Um, okay. Right here. But <laughs> yeah, hold on. I'm here at Parliament, okay, and uh -huh. Chris. Uh, took me there for a tour because I said, hey, I want to go see um, Parliament. He said, okay, I'll take you, mate. I said, okay, all right, let's go. So we went there, and there's a bunch of people at nighttime, as you can tell. And uh -huh. I painted this, uh, and I said, Chris, let's go to one of these side rooms and light up a joint, man. You know what I'm saying? And he said, yeah, man, I know what you're saying. Let's go light up a joint. I'm a police officer. I can arrest you, but let's not do that. I said, okay, <laughs> word. So we went to the side room, and I lit up a doobie, and we started smoking. Then the queen, unbeknownst to us, walks in the fucking room, and she goes, I smell the marijuana. And I uh -huh. said, word, queen, come smoke. Then with us, basic bitch. And she said, okay, <coughs> word, my nigga. And I said, all right. And she came in, and she started smoking. And then one of her guards busted in, and he got all pissed off, and he was like, why didn't y'all invite me? And I said, yo, I only have two doobies. And she said she wanted to join, and I ain't going to let the queen down. And he goes, word, all right. But he says, you need to put that down because the king is coming. And I said, fuck the king. I don't want to fuck with him. And then she said, no, I already fucked him. He has a <coughs> Anyway, back to the, the story. Um, <laughs> what the fuck is this? <laughs> the story is anyway, like weird. We go back to smoking the doobies. And she goes, okay, homies, I got to leave for a minute. I got to go talk to Parliament and tell them what the fuck is up. And I say, we're right here. here. And she goes, all right, be back, homies. And so... Uh, police officer Chris, he leaves the room for a minute too, and I'm high on, you know, fucking the marijuana. I, yeah, I'm high on marijuana. I got laced it with shrooms. I had hors d'oeuvres of shrooms and so. So wait, 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 LSD. wait. Hold up. You gave Chris what? the policeman and the queen shrooms and LSD and shit. Damn, bro, I ain't gonna bring, I ain't gonna just bring <laughs> marijuana. Marijuana brings munchies, bro. I gotta bring some food, too. I brought some shrimp. <coughs> I brought some uh, weed brownies to give you a little extra high. You know what I mean? And, Dude, slow down. You know, so she was over here in this side of the... You know, we're over here on this side, as you can tell where the... the started. And she's over here. My so bitch can't run. She's, She's lit as fuck, so she don't even care. So she just, she's over here jumping out the window, if you can see her. She's over here jumping out the window. Ah, I can't go that way. So she's lit as fuck. So we're over here, and and Chris, you you leave to go somewhere. And I say, damn, son, I'm tired. So I, I drop the doobie, and I just kind of let it go, and I knock out. So after a couple minutes, I wake up, and I say, yo, it's hot in here. Turn the heat off. You know, back in 1683, though, they didn't have heaters. They just had, you know, they had fires. So, I was like, yo, turn that heat off, bro. And Chris, you know, wasn't even in the room. And, and I woke up, and I was like, shit, yo, it's on fire. And she goes, and the queen comes busting in. She goes, yo, nigga, the, the building's on fire. Get out. Get out. Get out. And I said, all right, <coughs> I'll get out. Let me grab my doobies first. And she said, no, them motherfuckers stole that shit already. I said, no. And <laughs> she walked so out. Dumb, dude. She walked. She walked out and she flew down so the ladder. I'm done. You've been going on for like 10 minutes. <laughs> this is nothing. Hold on, I'm almost done. And she <coughs> over here and flew down the ladder and then got out and I'm like, yo, where's my ladder? And they already took the ladder down and everything like that. They're trying to firefight this bitch. And they over here throwing buckets and shit on, 
of water on the shit, like that's gonna do something. That ain't gonna work. So anyway, I get my aristocratical ass out of here. I go over here to this tower up here, and I'm standing on top of tower. See me on top of tower right there? Yeah, I see I'm it. holding my hands out. I'm saying, "Oh, nigga, my body's ready. God, take me. Let the fire take me." And then God said, "Nope," and he pushed me off, and I fell off, and I ended up landing on one of these people. I killed him on accident because I landed on him, but. Um, see, he's laying right here. He's right in the middle. You see him right there? He's right in the middle. Yeah, I see. Laying down. I made sure I painted him because I didn't want to leave him out because he saved my life. He was like <coughs> Jesus, and God was like, God was like, here, I'll push you on top of my son. Here you go. And he, he caught me, and I, he's dead now. But just like Jesus. Ah. And so we, uh, yeah. So and then after that, I went to Chris. And I was like, Chris, yo, homie, why didn't you wake me up? He said, man, as soon as that fire started, I dipped, homie. I was gone. I said, shit, bro, you should have caught me. You should have woke me up, man. You should have, you know, helped me. And then Chris was like, yo, I'll get you next time. Yeah, okay. <laughs> so we do that. And um, and then I said, you know what, man, I'm going to record this. Because I said, God saved me that day. See, I'm looking at the thing right now. I was like, God Tony, saved where'd me you that go? day. Because I was I'll in that fire. And he was like, baby, I'm going to save you. You have better things to do in life. And I said, word, God saved me. And he did. No, he stop running, Jesus. stop running. And you know, the guy's name, I never caught the guy's name. I can't, name. I he's like right behind head. me. But I swear he was Mexican, <coughs> his name is Jesus. Weird coincidence, am I right? Okay, so his name is Jesus, but you were in the England. Yeah, what is that, bro? Is that bad? You think Mexicans don't go to England too? Back in 1883 yeah. or whatever? 1683, sir. Get your Spaniards. Right. Yeah, Spaniards, you're right. Spaniards. Right. No, they didn't right. have like names like that, though. They probably so, like, Jose, cause like, oh, cause like, Billy, oh, how are you so fucking so, fast? So now the, the so, queen is I don't know. on her oh, journey to queen, find her yeah. tampon. No, no, the queen, the, no, hold on. Let me tell you about the queen, though. That bitch, she kept coming back. She said the dick was too good, and she kept coming back. So I said, bitch, I, I don't want to deal with you no more. And she's like, well, you are the only supplier of, of good weed. And I said, all right, all right, then I guess you can come back, but I ain't giving you a dick no more. I gave it to her one more time after that, and I was just horny. But anyway, she came back. She was like, <clears throat> she was like, man, that weed got me fucked up. I said, all right, I know. I got that good shit growing in the back. And she was like, yeah, where are you at? Where are you growing? You know, that bitch, you know what that bitch did to me? What'd she you turned do? the cops on me. She turned you on me, motherfucker. She said, yo, he is uh, growing weed. He's growing that purple sticky punch in the backyard. You need to go get his ass. <laughs> I said a word. and Or no, you, I'm sorry. You said word. And you were like, word, I'll go get him. And you know why you said word? Because you were pussy whipped, son. She gave you the pussy one time. And yeah, you were like, silly. oh. <laughs> Come on, now. Like, I'll turn on that motherfucker real quick. You pussy, overrunning pussy, me. Pussy, pussy. And so you, you know, I think it's to my right. Clean the hoe. So she, she go over there. She's telling you that, oh, you mean <coughs> your punch growing? You said I'll go get him, cause you know where I live. You know where I stay, homeboy. And then so you, um, <laughs> shut the you fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> so you go over there and you, you talk so about. So done. You talk about Alex. You talk about Alex. Gage. Gage, open the door. I said. I said no, homie. Why? What do you need the? What do you need to open the door for? And you go, homie. I want to buy some weed. And I was like, no, nigga, I ain't growing no more weed. Go away. And he said, no, I know you're growing weed back there. I said, how you know? He said, bitch. Okay, okay, no, hold on, hold on, weed. Alex. Why are you telling a story <laughs> that is made, like, way back then and there's weed in it? <laughs> what the fuck? Weed's, weed's been through the ages, bro. Weed's been through the ages. See this whole... I, I take that back. This fire wouldn't even fucking... I mean, it was started by me, but, you know, not intentionally. But all them mother over here. here Last high one's over here. Oh, no. You know how you can no. tell they're high? Because they're all looking at the fire. They're all high because they're looking at the fire. They're fascinated by that motherfucking fire because they're high as shit. They're on cloud nine, motherfucker. They're thinking, oh my god, what is that? Gage, you died two minutes in. I know. And freaking Austin lasted <laughs> 30 life, minutes. Story of my life, bro, lasted two minutes. No, you that <laughs> right, you'd be fine. <laughs> <coughs> he screamed, seriously? Two. No, bro, I only, I only screamed twice. Because I, I came the first minute and I came the second minute. Look, I both times. I'm going to tell you, I went in a square like look, five look, times. Oh, it didn't work. 
God damn it. I made a chode, you see that? Yeah, I, I see it. it. Look at my <laughs> look at my character. I went back and I went back <laughs> and went back the other way. <laughs> fix your mic, Yo, fix your mic, fix your mic, fix your mic. Chris gonna be sitting in the area by ourselves. Yeah. <laughs> Austin's over there by himself. Philly done fucking made his Yo, own Yo, Philly, path over Philly there. they were they were working together. And look, that's us right there. Yeah, yeah. We're looking at over we there. We met. I we I seen you at some point. <laughs> you two at some point. Look, Dude, that was us. That was us right there. Talking, talking about the art. <laughs> For the whole thirty minutes. Yeah. yeah. Y'all walk past us too. Yeah, oh I my know. god, they did. <laughs> I didn't even see him. <laughs> I, <thought laughs> I did. I did. I just didn't stop for him because they were looking at fucking paintings on the wall. <laughs>